a worker needs to send an alert or a signal uh, outside the building or outside the place to inform uh, his employer or employer needs to inform a worker that the place is getting dangerous and he has to leave the place. Uh, another use case could be a car accident, it could be fatigue. We have different uh, um, types of sensors, so we have some force sensors, so you can send some signals with your hands, you can send signal with your tool, so you can, it's based actually on Morse code, so it's something simpler but it's based on Morse code and you can send signal outside. And we have two vibrating devices here and you receive vibrations from outside. There is an earpiece um, that works in harmony with an app and uh, that is uh, through the sensors that this helps uh, the visually impaired uh, person to navigate, find their way around, especially indoor uh, areas. Uh, it tells uh, through the audio piece, it tells about what the what is what is around which stores are around where to turn if there is any block roadblock and it just helps the visually impaired individual uh, to to get around and find their, find their way This is showcasing some new low-powered cellular technology that's extremely innovative and allows us to create devices that can operate without being plugged into the wall. And, and this is an example of showing how that technology can work um, from a perspective of fitness and health. To be able to show how many times somebody punches a bag, to show how hard they're punching a bag, all live and in real time. It has a G sensors on it. Basically, what G sensor does is it senses uh, the vibration as well as a tail. So once those uh, activities are detected, it will generate the alarm, and then alarm message will be sent through the IoT network, and then you can receive those informations on your handheld devices like a smartphone, mobile phone, and etc.
you have to register your faces into the device initially. Once you have done that, just press button. And then you activate the safe. And then you keep close. And recognize my face. And it will open the door for me. Hola. The range of applications, particularly in the industrial IoT, we're seeing for efficiency and the growth in productivity, it's all being demonstrated now. So we're seeing being able to make more things, grow more crops, improve people's health. So there's such a diversity of applications.